Priya Brahma. Today, I stand before you to talk about a very special day of our country, Republic Day. First of all, I wish all of you a very happy Republic Day. Republic Day is our national festival and is also known as Gantantra Divas. We all know that India got independence from British rule on 15th August 1947. On 26 January 1950, the Constitution of India came into effect. On the same day, Dr. Rajendra Prasad became the first president of our country. Do you know Indian Constitution is the longest written constitution in the world? It was written by a committee headed by Dr. B. R. Ambedkar. Constitution lays the foundation of our country and outlines the rights and duties of its citizens. It ensures that every Indian citizen is protected and empowered. Republic Day is celebrated with great enthusiasm throughout India. This year, we are celebrating the 75th Republic Day of our country. There is a grand Republic Day parade headed Rajpath, New Delhi. Rajpath is now known as Karatavyapath. This parade is a symbol of our unity and diversity, representing various cultures and traditions. It also showcases India's defense capability. The parade lasts for approximately 90 minutes. French President Emmanuel Macron is expected to attend the 75th Republic Day Parade as a special guest. On this day, schools, colleges and organizations have flag hosting ceremonies, cultural events and other patriotic programs. Today, we all should remember the sacrifices made by various freedom fighters and leaders who fought for India's independence. It is a day to remember our past, celebrate our present and look forward to a bright future. Let us all pledge to work together for a peaceful and prosperous India and make India a superpower. Jai Hind, Jai Bhai.